you have to do a double bomb jump. I guess I have been timing down pretty well. So with all three of those... Yeah. Here is item number 15. There's stuff left, then certainly not much. Alright, so... Yeah, I guess I'll go this way. And save there. Now let's see if I can try do it on the first try this time instead of going the wrong way. I've seen some guides that say that you can only get the uh, that energy tank after after beating the next big enemy, but that's not true. Three. on my first try to find one. Well, actually, I usually find this on my first try. It's just that I'm trying to go somewhere else. So I have three energy tanks now, and that makes me feel somewhat less fragile. going on there? That's what it looked like. Okay. I'll be coming back here shortly, but for now, I'm just going to save. This game does have a one of my few complaints about this game is that I think the way it's designed, there's more leg work required than maybe should be. You have to go back and forth and back and forth way too many times. Maybe it could have been designed in a way that required less of that. Tree Hall, is it called? No, Arboretum. That reminds me of my college. That was a nationally registered Arboretum, is, I should say. Very pretty campus. Alright, keep that and scan one of the runic symbols. Ten deals of four, you need to scan four of them. Two. Alright, there's some more boss pies here. Fry him. Dead. 
go. <laughs> yeah, busted high. Oh, that's number three. There's another. They're gonna be more war wasps. All right, here's the scan I was talking about that I couldn't get with when the runic symbol was there. Venom weed. This is like tango weed, except that they it hurts you. As with tango. Whoops. That wasn't what I meant to do. Um, as with tango weed, shoot, shoot it, or even just shoot near it, and it will retract for several seconds. But you can't kill it. Now that's what I meant. Alright, scan that already. Did that already. Oh wait, is that the last one? Come on. Alright, yeah, that was the last one. And no fifth symbol to activate here. You can actually get right over that gate by double bomb jumping, but yeah, I'm not using shortcuts like that. Not when it involves like a you know quest critical thing. I would have used it to get that expansion if I could. I'm not sure if it's possible to do it like that though. Yeah, see, that energy is too far. Alright, so shoot this before you go into morph ball mode. Because the bomb wouldn't have a very big range. Okay. Made my way to the top here. Break this block. Yeah, you will roll downhill easily when you're in more fall form. The music has stopped. Or changed. It's easy to take damage here from these various aggressive plants. Try not to. All if you do is not that big of a deal because get it repaired by busting these brakes. Oh, that won't repair it. <laughs> that will. This is ultra energy. And that restores an entire tank. I don't need it right now. But you may at this point. And here is the first major boss of the game. I can't go back through that door. Well, and will not be able to for a long time. Now, notice that mirror. That's an important detail. So you want to have three energy gates before you get here. This is Flagra. Bosses will take longer to scan than other creatures. Another one time scan. And this is the source of the poison in the Chozo Ruins. Um, you can't damage this guy directly. At least not by hitting its upper part. Now, important this is another one time scan in this battle. This is the flogger technically. You can scan any of them, but just make sure to get both scans. Anyway, you can stun flogger by hitting it. What you want to do is get to the mirror that's been that's shining sunlight on him, and knock it out of place by shooting it a few times in a row. And then when he's stunned, go into one of these things, because the tentacle's not there, and lay a bomb. Now Fogger is in much pain. And now two mirrors are in Now he only needs one to be in place. Oh yeah, those plants, I think they'll hurt. But they won't 
stick around here now. You can... Whoa. Yeah, those plants are over. Now, as soon as there are two mirrors, we will, yeah, do that. We'll knock mirrors back into place. Now, learning to dodge is very handy because it lets you get around more quickly. So stun him before he can recover. 